Hey guys, welcome to Home Sweet Homeschool. If you're new here, my name is Ashley and I'm a homeschooling mom to one. And in today's video, I'm gonna share with you what we're planning on using for the 2025-2026 homeschool year. So I plan to, over the next couple of months, April, May, maybe even into June, start sharing some things that are we are for sure going to use next year, and then some thoughts and ideas for next year. If you've watched my videos in the past where I've released what we're using as our curriculum for the following year, I do that in like April or May, and then come August, it's like somebody else has taken over our bodies and we end up doing something else. And so I don't want to do that this year. So my plan is to talk through our options for next year. Um, what are some ideas we would like to use for the different subjects? And then in August, I'll actually let you know what we're going to use. So if you want to see what we've used in the past, we've been homeschooling since my son was in the fourth grade. And so he'll be going into the 11th grade. So we've used a lot of different things. So definitely check out some of my older videos. Um, for the most part, we've been using unit studies. Um, we've used we've used a variety of things. So just to check out some of my older things. But today, I am sharing something that I'm for certain going to use next year because it is something that has proved itself time and time again, and we're going to continue to use it because if something works, we're not going to change it. Okay. So our math curriculum for the 2025-2026 homeschool year is Learn Math Fast. Now, a lot of people don't know about Learn Math Fast, and it's really great. I'm actually going to link their website down below because I want you to go and check it out. I want you to read the note from the author and her uh, why behind creating this curriculum. I want you to read how to do Learn Math Fast because there's a lot of different ways. I mean, you can use this as supplemental. You can start your younger kiddos that are ready to add and subtract and learn those math facts. Um, you can use this, like we use this as our core math. This is just what works for my son who has ADHD. And so I want you to go and just scour their website because it is full of such good information and she can explain it a lot better than I can. So at this point going into next year, we will have went through all of the levels. So you start at very, very basic, which is adding, subtracting, multiplying, dividing, and getting really solid on those math facts. And you can go all the way through algebra one, algebra two, and high school geometry. Now we went in the order of what I did in high school, which was algebra one, geometry, algebra two. But I think she recommends doing algebra one and two and then high school geometry. But of course you can decide what's best for your home and for your child. Now, this book, um, it can be handed directly to your student if they just want some, if they just want to get math done, they just want to learn what they need to know and get it finished, you can hand this to them. They can read through the lessons and do the worksheets and even check it themselves because that's how easy it is to use. My son, though, does like for me to actually teach the lessons to him, and I don't mind doing that at all. I got myself a little whiteboard, and I write up on the board. I'm also trying to teach him how to take math notes, and we do the lesson together, and then he works on the worksheet. So the lessons, now, it does say you can do math in like 20 minutes a day, and I will say, like, we've been going through geometry this year. We did the basic geometry book and the high school, we did them in the same year, and we are struggling um, with the high school geometry. Not that anything's wrong with the program, it's just really, really difficult to understand. It was something I did not get in high school, and so me trying to teach it, I will say using this has helped me understand it better, and so we're just kind of taking it slow. But all the other books, we do the lesson, um, and we just stretch them out. So there's, there's like in this one, in volume six, which is algebra two, which is what we'll be moving into, there are 15 chapters. And within those 15 chapters, there are chapter tests, and then there's a final test. And so you'll see that throughout all of their, their books. The thing that I love about it is if I do want to stretch it out, if I want him to have more practice so I can make sure he truly understands it, as long as you've purchased these materials, you can access their supplemental worksheets. And so I go on there and print those if they're available. That way he can practice it again. 
Um, or one day we can use the worksheet for guided practice where we do things together and then he can do one on his own. I love the supplemental worksheets. You can also go and print, like this is the worksheet for the lesson. If you don't want your child to write in the book, say you want to use this book with another child or you want to sell the book, you can actually print these actual worksheets on their website as well and then you can um, use this again and again or sell it. So. We really enjoy it. Now, I will say all the ones that we've had have just been in black and white, and I know that some of them do have some color now, and I actually picked this one up, um, this Algebra 2 book up, and it does have some color in it. See the red? Um, red and blue. Now, you're going to say, well, that's not very colorful. No, it's not the good and the beautiful. I mean, it's, it's not that, but my son doesn't want that. You know, I love things that are beautiful. I do. But my son's just like, give it to me straight. Like, just tell me what I need to know and let's move on with our life. And so, this one is one of the first ones that we have had in color. So, that has some color in it. And when I say that, it is just like the red and the blue ink. So, I think some of her other ones that she, oh, here's some brown. We're talking about some chocolate, I think. So there's more, I haven't been through all of this yet. So there are some colors in here and I think some of her other ones may have that in there as well. We've just been using this for a while now and so um, most of ours have just been black and white. But what I love about it is it is so to the point and it's written in such a conversational tone. It is so easy to understand. If you have a child like mine who doesn't like math online, he doesn't like any online classes, and so he appreciates that he can just get this in book form. And so you just work through the lesson. This is like lesson two, so you would read through all of this. And the lessons really vary in length. Like this one is a couple of pages. Our geometry one, the book has had some that have like 10 pages of information and some that have two. It just depends on what you're doing. And so then they do this worksheet. So this would be their work from that lesson and then you can print the supplemental worksheet and they have something else to work on. My most favorite part um, of this, other than it being so conversational and so easy to understand, is the answer key that is in the back. I appreciate an answer key that works the problem out for you because sometimes it's hard to pinpoint exactly where somebody went wrong or maybe I'm confused about how to answer it and I love to see it already worked out for me. And that is what they do in here. So you do have like the problem and they've completely worked out the answer. So you can say like, okay, right here is where you messed up. And I love that about it. Like that is one of my favorite, favorite things about this. And so they're gonna give you all the solutions. So if you're one of those parents that don't just want an answer key that just delivers the answer, you wanna see it worked out, Learn My Fast has that in there. So we love it. I could go on and on about this. I do have a couple of flip throughs of what some of them look like on the inside. If you would like to see Algebra 2, let me know and I can flip through it. But um, definitely check out their website. Like I said, I'll have it linked down below. This has worked for my son so well. And so I want everybody else to know about it. So check out their website. If you have any questions about Learn Math Fast, there's a placement test on their website, all that good stuff. Um, leave any questions or comments down below. Let me know what you're using for your high schooler for math next year. And as always, thank you so much for watching.